Welcome to another video by VA Music Ministry. I'm the founder and president, Vincent Alexander, and got a free video for y'all today. I got my nephew with me on the organ. Can I hear just a little bit? Just give me a little something, something. Oh, on the organ? Yeah, just give me a little something, something. He's mic'd up and everything, so. Uh, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. We're gonna start off with a word of prayer, uh, but after the word of prayer, we're gonna get into some shout alternatives. A little disclaimer out there. I'm not good at shouts or none of that, but we've kind of been working together. Uh, he's up and coming, and we kind of just been working on some different stuff because I'm gonna be honest with you, when I used to do shouts, when I used to play in church, I got tired real quick. So I'm gonna show you some different alternatives you can do to where uh, it's, it's really, really nice. So here we go. Father God, we love you, we thank you, we honor you, Father God. We ask right now your love us in Jesus' name, Father God, that you just use us to give back to your people. In Christ Jesus' name we do pray, amen. All right, let's get started, y'all ready? So anybody, you already know, first thing you need, you need either a drummer or you need that shouting track. So let's hit that shouting track. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Yeah, let me hear it. Hold on. Turn that organ up just a little bit. I can't hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah let me hear it. Now, you hear that? You got the loop. You got the organ. It's time. Uh-oh, and then you got the piano coming in. But let's just say, I want you to just do the regular. I want you to just do the regular, all right? I want you to play the bass. Nephew's gonna play the bass, all right? Here we go. One, two, three, yeah. All right, now look, now look, I'm already tired. My fingers is tired. So what can we do? Y'all ready? Let's do this. We're going to teach y'all a few different things you can do. Everybody should know this. Everybody, okay, y'all know that. We ain't trying, we, we there to give you some alternatives. So here we go. We're going to do the first bass line. Here we go. Yeah, okay. You know what? I'm going to turn it up just a little bit for y'all. Because I don't think y'all can feel it. Let me turn up this first bass line. You ready, nephew? Yeah, yeah. You hear that? That's the bass. It's 65. So that look, that blesses me because I ain't got to do all this. And I ain't, you know, your hands just, so this is just. So I'm going to teach you that real quick. All we have is a G minor 11, F sharp minor 11, to the F minor 11. Yes, now, sir, say them names. <laughs> <laughs> so look, let's break it down. Now I play it, this is the Jamal Hartwell way. I call this the Jamal Hartwell way. Where your hands kind of overlap, but you can do it. You can do, uh, you can do it like this. Different melody a little bit, but. But same thing, all right? So my left hand, I got F, A, B flat, D, and then just take it down a half set. Remember, the bass note is either going down a half step bah, 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 or it's going bah, bah, bah. You can do either one. It doesn't matter. As long as you get to that six and that five, all right? So you can go half step down to the five or you can go so bah, 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 bah. all right? So that's what, it, that's what it's going to sound like. Uh, now, like I said, on the right hand, you can do C, F, A. Let's just say you want to double up. You can do it like that. A, B flat, C, F. Just take it down half steps. All right, so you can just. No, I'm sorry. Ah, no, 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 there we go. All right, or. I like it because it's kind of more of a cluster. It's in there together. You're chilling. It's good. You don't feel like doing a whole bunch of. So you can just do. All right, so let's practice that one more time. Morgan, let's do it. Two, three, and up. Now, the question. 
question is, where does that come in? Let's just say you are doing that. Let's just say you're doing that run. You know what I'm saying? You're doing that. And the, and the preacher says, break it down. Or the singer says, break it down. The praise and worship, whoever says, break it down. Okay, now when you break it down, you ain't got to do it. You ain't got to do all that. You know what I'm saying? You can just now, uh, they want you to break it down a little bit. They still want you to shout. They still want that track going. They still want the organ, piano. They want everybody in there. But now this is just kind of like a, we still in the shout, but we, you know, we ain't got to go crazy. All right, so let's do it one more time, and then we're going to show you a way that my nephew, J.C. Carney, uh, Jade and Michael Carney flipped it. So we're going to get to that in a second. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Nephew, I almost forget. There's a way if you want to, you can do it just a little different. That second chord over the C or the F sharp, you can play E, A flat, B flat, C sharp or D flat if you want to be correct, A flat. Yep. So you can play it like that. All right. Or you can do it the first way I showed you. So you basically just got that F major, E major, E flat major. All right, so that's a nice way. But guess what? Nephew decided he was going to flip it because he's under that new age. You know, the new school, they flip everything. So let's do this new way. You ready? We're going to do it. This is our bass line, too. So watch, watch what we do. Watch what we do. Here we go. One, two. Here we go. Just say you getting bored and let's just say my nephew said you know i got bored of that uncle vincent i don't like it we, I didn't, now, by I didn't the way say that. I didn't say we that. we got that from new zion we kind of we heard new zion do it shout out to new zion we heard them do it we said oh that's sweet you know what i'm saying add it in there even though our church does not shout i'm the pastor yeah we don't one day i'm gonna ask everybody just stand up and shout everybody they're gonna look at me crazy but anyway so <laughs> he added the Let's say if we was in C sharp, it would be the one, I mean the six, two, if we was in C sharp, but since we're in B flat, let's just say one, four, all right? Relative minor. Yeah, so the relative keys, the relative uh, B flat minors, the relative is relative uh, to C sharp major. So here we go, we got one, four, all right? So the way we're playing that, on the B flat, I got A flat, C, C sharp, F. My right hand is A flat, B flat, C, E flat. And then to the two. And then I'm just playing a regular F, uh, F sharp major add nine on both hands. All right, you got that? F sharp major add nine. It's not the same thing as F major nine, but I'm not gonna go into theory. So anyways. Real session. It's a real session. <laughs> All right, it's really, if you wanted to, to keep it simple, you can just play the B flat if you want, want to keep it simple and play the A flat major add nine over the B flat. Do that again. Like you doing this uh, three yeah, six you, and B flat. Yeah, you hear what he did? He did. I didn't do that, but that's cold. Okay. No, so okay. I'm just, yep. I heard what you did. Yeah, because I actually do it moving in C sharp when go. Look, we getting way off track. Don't get, see you can't get us around each other. We start feeding off each other. So here we go. <laughs> so let's now let's say you wanna like look, we kinda going like worship shout. I don't even know if that's a term. I don't even know. So we're going bah, bah, bah. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of beautiful. What can't if you wanna that. make it churchy again? <laughs> Huh? Can you say that term that change don't like? 
Yeah, we can't say that either. We can't say that either. Uh uh-uh, uh. It's forbidden. But what if we wanted to go churchy? Here we go. Let's try it. So this time instead of doing we're gonna go work. I mean we're gonna go churchy. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. What I did was, I did that churchy one, four. And then we played the dominant on the four. All right, so you ready? Let's do that one. So all this is the same. All right, D, A flat. My right hand is C sharp, F sharp, B flat, C sharp. To the C sharp G, right hand is C sharp, F. A, I mean F, G, B flat. So it's uh, now look, I ain't, I'm not gonna go in because I'll be here all day trying to just, you know what I'm saying? When you start doing stuff like that, it's just feel. All right, so but we'll, uh, maybe we'll get into that here in a little bit. But my nephew's, you know, he's got to go because he's got practice and everything. So let's go ahead and keep moving on. But remember, you can do this. Okay, that's one, right? The other one is. Or you can go churchy. All right, you got that? So here we go, here we go. We're gonna go to the next one. The next one, nephew, I wanna make sure I get this one right. I believe it was the last one, wasn't it? Yeah, we're gonna go to this last one, okay? Is it that one? Yeah, we're gonna go to this last one. You sure? Uh, Let's see. No, that's not it. No, nah, it ain't that. That ain't it. it. That ain't it. That's, that's not the last, last one. one. That's not the last one. You right. Okay, here we go. Y'all ready? <laughs> Here we go. By the way, I got to give a shout out to you for making all the bass lines and the loop and, and putting everything together. I'm just a humble servant, nigga. Hey, hey. Oh, yes, sir. Nah, okay, here we go. <laughs> all right. All right, here we go. We're about to do it. You ready? something just simple it's just a two five one and then you can do whatever melody line you want i think that was another new zion thing they did but let's do that two all right so i got c and if you got a bass player you don't have to play the c you can just play e and b flat my right hand is an a flat major e flat a flat c e flat all right you can play it like that you can but I usually do it like it. I don't know, just however you want to do it. That's probably a better way to play it. All right, so E flat, and this is over the five. Gotcha. Yeah, thank you. Over the five, E flat. Hey, I got a little bitty hands. I can't stretch like all these other musicians. E flat, A, right hand is C sharp, F, A flat, or that C sharp up top, so, and then to the one, D, A flat, my right hand is C, E flat, G, and B flat, all right, so, so you can do, which is C sharp, B flat, all right, you can create your own, so let's just say you want to do something else. And then you let's say uh, you might do. Uh, so all that is is just try to five six one. All right, so, oh, hold on, we, 
All right, so we, we're going we're gonna to get to that. Hold on a second. Let's just practice with that. Let's mess around with it real quick. Here we go. say we can do something you can also go down with it so all i did was b flat c c sharp uh, e flat f f sharp a i just kind of did something crazy or you can do you can do you can do it down so and a lot of y'all probably know that when you're doing. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all might know that movement. If y'all know that movement, it's just something that people do a lot, especially in C sharp. All right, so you can just go down, go up, but it's F sharp. And if, let's look at it like this. It's basically a C sharp scale. But instead of playing the A flat, you sharp it. You playing every note except for the A flat, you change it to A. Okay? So let's, let's look at it like that. And so you can also do something like this. You know what? what I'm saying? You can do something. Okay. <laughs> You silly. We're getting, we're getting crazy. So it's just, uh, let's, matter of fact, let's do it with the loop. All right. That's a, that's a trick, you know what I'm saying, that a lot of people do uh, in C sharp. A lot of people. All you're doing is playing a F sharp major to a F major. And you know if you if you know anything about drop twos, you take out that F sharp on your right hand and put it on your left hand and you beam, and then invert it. Go down, go down, go down, go down. All right, so. to where it's not really that difficult but mm. when you hear it it's like huh yeah it, it's but it's really simple just f sharp major that's f my major. testimony <laughs> <laughs> so let's try it in context <laughs> All right, so simple. Now, this is the last one, because look, nephew got to get out of here. I ain't trying to get in trouble with my sister. Is that the last one? Right uh, there? No, that get, one? no, that ain't the last one. We got one more. Oh, yeah. Because I got to show them that one move that oh, yeah. changed my life. Changed everybody's Hopefully, it changes lives. your life. All right, here we go. Uh, So let's, yeah, let, let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and do it. That's not, that's not the one. That ain't it. Here we go. Y'all ready? Here we go. So let me teach you that and then we'll go into just maybe some different things that I might do. So uh, the part two, this is part one, but part two, uh, hopefully we're going to try to give that away for free as well. But I'm going to have my nephew on piano and just 
pour out into y'all. Y'all ready? So this is three, four, up. Now, when I say up, of course it's diminished, but <laughs> for, for musicianship purposes, we say up because it's three, four, flat fives. You see what I'm saying? It's just you got Go to say Go ahead and explain it. Go so ahead and explain it. Up to make it easier. But you can also do three, four, diminish. But let's just say you don't want to play a diminish. You know what I'm saying? You're going to play something different. That's why you just kind of say up and, and just give a heads up to the bass player. Hey, we're going up. Yep, it's in relation to the right. bass. Yes, sir. So that, that's all. That's why we say up. But three, I'm playing C and F sharp, C, F, B flat. To On the four, we got C sharp, G, C sharp, F, G, B flat in my right hand. All right, then we got the diminish. Diminish seven to be exact. All right, here we go. Are you ready? And I'm just playing. For the sake of time, I'm gonna try to get through these to where I'm not spelling everything out. All right, that's over the five. All right, so let's. All right, so now you're not doing all the. So you don't have to do all that syncopation and moving all your hands off it, but. And think about it, you're still in the shell, everybody's still going, So, but it gives you kind of a chance to rest your fingers just a little bit. Now there's a couple things you can do. Uh, nephew, you was doing some stuff. He don't want to show you everything he was doing earlier. He was doing two feet and crazy. And if he did that, we were just gonna have to break it down. It's gonna be a 45 minute video at least. But uh, you can do you can do stuff like that, like I taught you. Yeah. You can do you can, you know what I'm saying. You can, let's see if we can think of some more. I'm gonna give you one here in a second. Let's do it. Between, it, it's just inspired by Josiah Maddox. Uh, shout out to him, but I heard him do something crazy. I think on Design Service, they was doing. And then he went like crazy. And then he went to. Like, huh? And Eric, like, I, like, I was like dumbfounded. Yeah, Christian posted it. Christian posted it. He was like, huh? But, you know, when I actually sat down and listened to it, I realized, and it might not be exact note for note and everything, but it was the concept that was the same. Uh, he went to that worship movement. All right, so let's go to, to the two. E flat, B flat, right hand is, get it, F. F sharp, A flat, B flat, to the four. And mind you, we're, I'm acting like I'm in uh, C, sharp. C sharp now. So F sharp, C sharp. My right hand is A flat, B flat, C sharp, F. To the six, B flat, F. Right hand is C, C sharp, E flat, A flat. And I'm kind of flicking to that C. To the, and my left hand is C sharp, A flat. Right hand is E flat. And C, of course, or you can play the A flat too as well, but 
but it's ah and then repeat it but he did it low he did you can do ba so ba which it's amazing for him because he's actually a drummer so he understand syncopation and stuff like that because his timing is amazing so coming from him was like oh wow that was sweet but uh like i said he did some move up which you can learn different stuff like that uh but yeah that that's stuff that you know ain't nothing but then go back to church all right so let's do it one more time we're gonna get up out of here one two yeah. Now let's do it again. You ready? Here we go. Three, <laughs> We're gonna go into a shout. Yeah, you go into but look, a shout look, right look. there. This is part one. Like I said, we got part two coming, and as we close out, I just want to thank everyone for all the support for VA Music Ministry, uh, all the people we've had on. I, I really just want to thank everybody from the Lamar Gerards, the Cheneys, the Cartwrights, the Jarrell Littles, the Joe Logans, everybody that has played a part, uh, the K Trons, and I'm forgetting people now Christian Bishop, Jaden Arnold. Uh, everybody that has actually been on the website, G.J. Hatcher, can I think of anybody else? Sherman Williams came on, killed it with his worship. Sean Clay? Uh, Sean Clay came on. Uh, I can't think of nobody else. Hopefully, I don't know. Sheridan came. He didn't do any tutorials, but he did, you know, a live stream. You already me. said TJ? TJ. How can I forget about TJ? I just want to thank all of them. They have poured so much into y'all. And uh, this video, like I said, of course, you already know it's absolutely free. But part two, we're going to try to bring back and just bless the people. We just want to pour out into musicians to, you know what I'm saying, make things a little maybe easier. Because let me tell you something. Growing up in the 90s, they didn't have access to this. Early 2000s, they didn't have access to this. It was, wasn't was until about 2009, 10, and around that time period to where you started to get, uh, started to get like YouTube and stuff. So uh, God bless. Thank you for all the support. We will see you on the next video.